The Bath Wild Kittens 2-0 on the softball season, scheduled to host Mansfield Christian this afternoon. That game, of course, washed away. And as Mark Koontz reports, while the glow from last year's state title shines at Bath, they'll have to replace some key seniors. Reynolds is now pitching in college, leaving Bath with a major hole to fill. Future Toledo Rocket Julia Miller will move 43 feet from her usual catching position to the circle and takes over as Bath's number one pitcher. Um, she's really stepped into that role and been willing to work and kind of sacrifice for our team. I'm so used to being behind the plate that this year it's a big transition, but I've worked so hard in the offseason to become the pitcher that's the number one pitcher. Julia's doing great. Th being thrown into pitching from catching is obviously a big transformation that she had to get used to, but she's doing great at it and I give her props for that. You know, Kimmy could really rock the fire in there and um, really kept batters off balance and did a nice job that way. Julia really understands the game and situations on where to throw batters and what to throw them. Um, you know, she just has a lot of confidence out there and, and her, knows that her defense is going to work behind her. What I learned from them is just to be confident in yourself. Kimmy carried herself with such confidence. And as a batter, you can see that, and that's intimidating, so I'm just going to try to work on my confidence. With eight seniors on this year's team, Bath has plenty of experience, and after winning it all as juniors, they say they are still hungry for more. It was definitely a great feeling having the state title, but that doesn't mean anything for this season. We still have to get back on the diamond and work hard. Last year, we reached our ultimate goal, which was state, and that's our goal every year, but this year, we just really take it game by game, and we're really, we are really loose, and we're not trying to like build up any hype or anything. We just definitely know that we, we losing a pitcher, we have to step up, and our defense has to step up, and nothing's guaranteed. Yeah, a lot of people have really stepped up, put in extra work in the offseason because they're not satisfied of, of where we were left off last year. We know we lost two key players in our lineup with Jenna Holler and Kimmy Reynolds and know that we have two big holes to fill and so they're all trying to step up and fill those roles for them. Yeah, we have a great group of girls returning, um, but we do have high expectations knowing we have a great group returning, um, lots of leadership skills, and our hope is to um, compete well in the WBL and have a long tournament run. With the Wild Kittens, Mark Kutz, Sports Report.